Hey and welcome to Quirky Books with Katie. Today I'm going to be talking about my thoughts on the new Shadowhunter pilot. And in case you guys didn't know, ABC Family, or I think its new name is actually Freeform, had a has a new show called Shadowhunters and it is based on the Mortal Instruments series by Cassandra Clare. I read the Mortal Instruments series probably about three or four years ago and I really enjoyed it. And I did see the first movie adaptation that came out about two or three years ago, was not a huge fan. So when I heard that ABC Family was going to come out with a new adaptation, I was very hesitant because I wasn't really a huge fan of the first adaptation and I just think that this series is very hard to adapt. There's a lot of different nuances and plot and so many different characters and I feel like it's something that's very difficult to adapt and once the casting came out I kind of had a little bit of faith and went into it with kind of low expectations because I saw some of the promos and let me tell you it made the series look very cheesy so I'm going to give you guys a bit of a warning in advance if you were a huge fan of this pilot and loved it you might not want to watch this video because I wasn't really a huge fan of it and I'm kind of going to go into the reasons why I did not like it now my biggest issue probably first doesn't really directly affect me but people that didn't read the book. I felt like if you have not read this book series and you watched the pilot you would be completely lost and have no idea what was going on. I felt like this pilot did a terrible job of explaining what ha what this world is really about. The pilot is the first episode of the series and it's supposed to draw you in and make you want more and I felt like this was just a hot mess of confusion. It didn't really explain what anything was. It started out with Jace, Isabel, and Alec kind of fighting demons and then going into it from there and I just felt like you did not get any explanation. You didn't really even find out what a shadow hunter was besides someone that protects humans from demons and I just felt like if you had not read the books this would be so confusing. I read the books and I was still confused as to what exactly was going on for most of the episode. I was just confused as to where exactly they were going. I was trying to figure out did this or did this not happen in the book. It was just not... I just felt like it was very poorly explained. Now this is something that may be expanded upon in future episodes, I'm hoping, but I feel like for someone who hasn't read the books, if they watch the pilot, they might not be very likely to check out future episodes of the series. So kind of from right off the bat, I could tell that I wasn't really going to be a huge fan of this pilot. Now I understand that pilots are often the worst episodes in the series. They're often made before the series gets a full order and episodes could get better. I'm probably going to end up watching a few more episodes, but I just, ugh, I was just really not a huge fan of this pilot. And I was kind of going on Twitter while the show was premiering and I feel like some people loved it and some people hated it. Now one of the main reasons that I really disliked the pilot was because of the cheesy dialogue. I don't really blame the actors for the execution of the dialogue but kind of the dialogue in and of itself and I feel like the script is something that's so basic and if you don't have a good script you're not going to have a good show. I felt like they were kind of trying to and capture kind of the spirit of the books in the dialogue but still trying to make it a little bit more modern but a lot of it just did not do it for me especially the line I think Clary called her mom a hashtag stalker mom and it was just very cheesy and it felt like they were trying too hard to relate to the youngins or the teenagers and it was just not very well done. Another thing that I really wasn't a fan of was the CGI and the special effects. Now I am involved with a lot of filmmaking so I'm probably more picky about this stuff than some people but I just felt like the special effects were horrendous. I mean I'm talking about at worse than they were in the first movie adaptation. It was just very, you could tell it was a lot of like green screen and a lot of computerized special effects that weren't done very well and that might have been just because the show had a very low budget. I mean ABC Family isn't exactly a huge network but it really made the plot a lot less believable. Now something else very general that I wasn't really a huge fan of in this pilot was probably just 
the plot in general. It has been a very long time since I've read the books and I felt like a lot of things were different and not necessarily in a good way. I felt like they were just trying to make it this cool new fantasy show without actually putting any effort into the fantasy elements of the show. Something else that I'm not really sure of is characters. Now, you guys know that I'm a very big stickler for character development, but I felt like I just wasn't really drawn to any of these characters in this TV show. I love them in the books, but in the TV show, the only one I even found probably remotely interesting was Isabel. Now, I do quite feel kind of bad that this entire video has basically been a rant about how much I didn't like the pilot, but I mean, I wanna be honest with you guys, I was just really not a fan, but then again, I wasn't really going into it with that high of expectations. And I probably, possibly am going to check out more episodes of this series. I'm not really expecting it to be anything great, but I do realize that this is a pilot. It could get better. So let me know in the comments down below if you guys want me to do more episode reviews or just let me know what you thought of the pilot. If you liked it, let me know why. If you disliked it, let me know why. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you subscribe to my channel and I will talk to you again soon.